There's so many Little League All-Star teams, so many rounds and layers you have to get through. And I'm sure when you're a little kid, it's an amazing experience to win all those games to get there and then to get all the exposure that you get when you make it. I grew up in Arizona, hot but year-round baseball, a lot of activity outside. The Little League fields, I thought they were big. <laughs> you look back now and it's obviously the smallest field you can play on. My name's Clay Bellinger. Uh, I'm a firefighter. In 2007, we had a club ball team. We got together a bunch of kids, and I was one of the coaches on the Channel National All-Star team that got to go to Williamsport and play in the Little League World Series. Hi, Clay Bellinger, coach, Chandler, Arizona. Hi, Cody Bellinger, play first place. My son Cody was one of the players on that team. Playing in front of 20 to 30,000 fans as an 11-year-old, 12-year-old is pretty spectacular. Welcome to the Chandler, Arizona team to the baseball tonight set. Cody Bellinger is here. Our offense is really good and our defense, you, we don't make much air, so. If you get just a condensed version of what could be, you know, life in, in the big leagues with all the cameras and the media. Your dad's right there on the field with you, knowing that your dad knows what it takes to make it all the way to the real world series. With Pete there on the field in Williamsport for the Little League World Series with you, that's got to be uh, even more special. Clay Bellinger, a former major leaguer. Clay Bellinger was a guy who, who really had to scrap and fight for every uh, day he had in the big leagues. He was there certainly at the right time. I mean, he played for four teams and they all made the World Series. He played for the 99 2000 Yankees, his two championship teams. I definitely remember the World Series parades in New York City. It's like what you envision. There's so many people in downtown and they're throwing like confetti. So 10 years in the Myers to three years in the World Series is pretty unique, you could say. Looking back on it, the people in that clubhouse that I got to be around was pretty uh, unbelievable. I mean, anytime you see your dad playing, you know, you want to do it. And you know, when you realize you're actually, you know, pretty good at it, you know, I think you just, you fall in love with it. Little League, it's about having fun, you know, love of the game. That's all I would say, have fun and keep playing. It was, it was probably the most fun I had playing baseball. Like I said, we played really well. You know, we lost. We would have loved to win two more games or three more games, but to be top four in the U.S., still a good time. At the end of the day, it doesn't really matter how you did. You got there, and that was the main goal. But, yeah, I think for me it was a little less pressure knowing that he was there and you see other players who've, who've gone through that experience who made it big. My dad played in the big leagues. I've gone as far as I can in the Little League World Series. It can drive you. I think that was the moment for me where I was like, I really want to do this. I could probably try to do this and kind of turn the switch a little bit, focus on it a little more. I was tiny when I was younger. I didn't hit my growth spurt till junior year of high school. Some guys on my team were superstars and they stopped working and everyone kind of passed them. For me, just kind of focus on the little things and then obviously once you get a little bigger, stronger, it kind of takes over. So we got drafted in 2013. It just kind of took off from there. Bellinger hammers the ball in the deep right field. Cody Bellinger is a rookie outfielder and first baseman for the LA Dodgers. He came up to the big leagues in April and started tearing it up. Cody Bellinger, you are ridiculous. The kid goes deep again. He's captured the imagination and the attention of the whole baseball world. Is this the guy who's going to hit 60 home runs and lead the Dodgers to the world championship? You know, we haven't seen a full season from him yet, so really anything's possible. You see your son doing what they love to do and actually playing well, and hopefully it'll last another 10, 15 years. Cody used to be Clay Bellinger's son. And now I'm, I'm Cody Bellinger's dad.